this old barn that you saw a horse barn there was these limbs up they were growing in the side of it so what it did was they made it to where the inside piece were running against this wall and this was pushing up in on it so we're just trying to go ahead and take care of the trees level it off so it all matches on the inside because we're planning on being here a while we want it to look right so we got these pavers in here we're trying to our dog lots are going in here so we're going to try to make it nice and level in there we bought 200 12 by 12 pavers we got some skinny ones to go we're trying to figure this out Progress for day one. Yeah. So we're back at it out here again today. We're gonna to try to finish up this slab. Try to get it nice. Looking really good. And uh, yeah, we'll see where else the day takes us. So this half acre lot here, we are having fenced off for our four dogs. Um, they're German short haired pointers. And we went through a guy at our church who does fencing for a living. And so he is helping us out here with this. Um, today's the last month of February, so we needed to be out of our rental farm by today. <laughs> and so the dogs and the chickens are the last thing things that we've been waiting on. Uh, Cause we still don't really have the greatest setup for chickens, but um, obviously the perimeter fencing is not quite done. Um, hopefully that will be done by this weekend. Um, so what we've done here though, is at least created a kennel space we used this old horse barn and converted it into a kennel. Um, and our males do not get along as our one has gotten older. That's changed over the last year. So we've got this section for Ava and Hunter, our older two. And then this section will be for, or vice versa, whichever. The other two will be separated on the other side, um, Ruger and Erin. <laughs> We had our guy, we said we needed something done so that we can move the, move the dogs um, by today. And so he literally a couple hours ago finished up this kennel space. Um, and then Cliff's bringing them home tonight. That's the whole thing. We have like a 10 by 10 kennel at the house. And so he's got a in that, in that setup, he also had put pavers down on the floor, just like he chose to do here. And so he's gonna leave the pavers there in the backyard, but he's bringing the kennel home um, and dog houses and dog beds and leashes and dog food and all the things um, to move him home. Yeah. Are you excited puppies are gonna be home? Yeah, are you excited? Yay. It's gonna be, I hope they love it. Cliff's a little bit nervous about them moving. By the time he gets home with them after work today, it'll be dark, if not, or close to dark. Um, and so we're actually going to have a light installed here. Um, there's power pole right here. And so we were told, right there, there, no, there. <laughs> um, we were told that it'd really, it'd be like less than 20 bucks to run power just right here. So that's the plan. That's the plan to get, because it gets dark out here at nighttime. Quite dark.
I see that. What do you mean the inside dogs? Oh, I want it. Yeah, I'd love for them to be inside, but Dad says they're outside still for now. Eli's got the feed barrel. Cliff's. Oh, there goes shingle. Um, we still have one more dog house that needs to come over, but um, Cliff could not get it out of the kennel, so we'll do that tomorrow. <laughs> you got it. Will it fit? It should. These are four feet doorways. You made it. <laughs> Try that again through this next doorway. What you thinking? How big are these? Did, do we know? Is uh, it like 10, ten by 10 or 10 by 10? Using this as a little dog house until he can get that. The other one's other not going to fit, so we either need to, we'll have to buy one that size. Oh, really? The other house we have is bigger than this oh, one? Oh, really? Oh, man. This nice. It's a nice one. Which one? The other, the bigger one. Yeah, it's almost too big for that space in there. Yeah, we'll eventually get 70 watt light up on that pole. Kind of. Oh, it's going up there. I thought yeah. it was coming here to no, the barn. See that light up there on that pole up there behind the house? Right. Yeah. So it'll be the same thing, but it'll be a lot brighter. Oh. It'll give us some light up here towards the front of the house. Oh, gotcha. Too. I thought it was coming here. So he's gonna come back. Fix this on the ground right here because it's kind of flimsy they'll they'll try to get out of there is that what's is a two by six what's currently separating the two there yeah so he'll, so put he'll them okay. on the base and I, eventually i'm gonna put them up top here too and kind of make it look nice okay but, hey. there's no food in there yet baby hang on wait let daddy let daddy pour it in uh. back up so they can jump down.